Hello YouTube, this is uh, Terrell with Big Time Nights here for another episode of House of the Dragon, episode 2, and uh, I'm not gonna recap really, uh, we're just gonna get right into it. Um, make sure you uh, watch your copy and uh, come over and uh, watch my reaction. Um, first episode had a build up, you know, it's, the story's progressing, you know, the death of the mother already. I don't expect the father to be around, uh, the king to be around long. But uh, like I said before, uh, I'm not really good with names, but I'm really good with faces. <laughs> so forgive me if I butcher names, but uh, we're just gonna get right into it. So, all right, here we go. Did they play this? Uh intro song in the first episode if they did i really didn't notice it but yeah it's iconic and uh, i kind of glad they they kept it but in a way maybe um it could have went with their own version and we would have grown to like that but it's whatever it's it's a kind of uh uh music <laughs> These intro scenes, like they kind of, they kind of matter because they they show you a, a lot of uh, the world and houses and um, things that could be a, uh, a predictor of uh, what's to come. But I have no idea what any much of it means. <laughs> There's rivers of blood and everything, so that that doesn't bode well. Uh, they are eaten alive by like crabs. It's crazy. With an army of his gold cloaks. Damon has squatted there for over half a year without even a protest from the crown. I'll caution you, Lord Callus. A seat at the king's table does not make you his equal. I have acted, Callus. I've sent envoys to Pentos and Volantis to see if we might find common cause. Ships and men are at the ready. The stepstones will be set. She's listening intently. You have Dragon Riders, Father. I was about to say, I thought she was just listening to uh, see how they uh, counsel each other so she could learn. But nope, she's directly involved. Or getting herself directly involved. It isn't that simple, Brunel. It would be a show of force. At least the princess has a plan. I only meant to wish at least... Perhaps uh, there's some better use for the princess's talents. You overstepped your uh, authority. <laughs> Even if these knights have combat experience, be all capturing poachers. Sir Kristen Cole. Yep, you know this one. Son of a steward of the Lord of Blackhill. There's no doubt Sir Kristen is a fine warrior, but houses such as Crickle and Malister are important allies of the crown. Seagard, for instance, is the realm's prime defense against Reavers from the Iron Eye. Man, this guy thinks he knows everything. What do I say? Whatever you wish. Is there anything in the gods today? keep thinking uh this uh the redhead <laughs> is not being completely genuine but her father is also using her but i don't know i don't know but it's this game of game of thrones got me feeling like i can't really trust any character yet <laughs> we'll see I don't even really trust the princess yet. I mean, we're we're just getting to know her. We'll see whose side I'm uh, going to be on. <laughs> the king seems uh, genuine, but I don't know. At the small council today, your grace, it was not my intent to make offense. 
He did pull the plug on his wife, though. But in his mind, he thought, I'll lose them both or save my son. I haven't given marriage much thought. It hasn't even been half a year since Emma passed. The realm expects you to take a new wife sooner or later, Grace. To strengthen your line and produce more heirs. You could not ask for a stronger match than Layla. Okay, we got some some time passing, a few months. So is the blood dude of Valerian? Like, uh, or is that what his ancestry is? Like, unite the two, how uh, you unite Targaryens and Valerians is what he says. So I'm guessing the cousin is definitely a Targaryen. So I'm I'm assuming he's a Valerian. I thought they were like extinct, <laughs> extinct. This is our best chance to save the digit. The maggots will remove the dead flesh and hopefully stop the advance of the rot. Where is he rotting from? Dearly loved my young lady wife. The pain of her passing still haunts me. And to be compelled to replace her for duty's sake. You are the king. This guy's a manipulator, man. She is just way too young, man. I mean, I guess you can marry her, but you can't really do anything for, like, <laughs> a good however many years. Like, she's... It would be a great honor to join our houses as they were in old Valeria. I would give you many children of pure Valerian blood so that we might strengthen the royal line. She's like repeating a rehearsed line. Yeah. <laughs> what did your mother tell you? That I wouldn't have to bed you until I turned 14. Oh, God. Just so young, freshman in high school. Jeez. That's is that's kind of what they were doing back in these times, man. Medieval times. This new wife will produce new heirs, and chances are better than not that one of those will be male. And when that boy comes of age and your father has passed, the men of the realm will expect him to be heir, not to you. Seems like she's getting glee from this. I must admit, I don't know Lena very well. I'm sure that she is good and kind, and that she will enjoy your company, as I have, Your Grace. As I have, man. These are the subtle words, language. She knows what she's doing. Why don't I become queen, your new wife? <laughs> this is a very kind gesture, Alison. Give him gifts, man. <laughs> Working that magic, man. She knows the way to his heart right now. <laughs> Damon has seized the Dragonstone and has surrounded himself. Army of gold cloaks and has now stolen a dangerous weapon. Scoria Drome, you babies. Scoria Drome and Damon Laitas. Drome and Drot so illes, Daridamos. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I will go to Dragonstone and drag Damon back to face justice Your myself. Grace. My apologies, Your Grace, but I cannot allow it. It's too dangerous. Damon is without limit. Let me go to Dragonstone. This was an honorable thing to do, to go uh, 
because you might die, but he might be up to something. No, he hates Damon. What am I saying? And Damon wouldn't like him. I've assembled 20 of your best household guards, my lord. So how about also be honest? I'm thinking like maybe he'll get under Damon's good graces and because he can see the tides flowing. Maybe Damon is going to, I don't know, but they don't like each other. So maybe he is just being brave. I want to see what his uh, wife of the veil looks like. <laughs> Welcome to Dragonstone, Otto. Your occupation of this island is at an end. You're to relinquish the dragon's egg, disband your army, banish your whore, and leave Dragonstone by order of his grace, King Vasco. Where is the king? I don't see him. His grace would never lower himself to entertain such a mummer's farce. Sir Crispin, wasn't it? Sir Crispin Cole, my prince. Ah, yes, apologies. I couldn't recall. Perhaps my prince recalls when I knocked him off his horse. Guys, you guys. There's going to be some bullshit, man. Damn, that looks giant. Oh, okay. It's hers. They had seats and everything. Daenerys was riding that shit bareback. <laughs> the reason that you were disinherited. If you wish to be restored as heir, you'll need to kill me. So do it. And be done with all this bother. He's not gonna do anything. I think he really loves his niece. Like deep down. Like they have a connection. And she knows that. She knows that. <laughs> Did she prove something to you? hand or uh or do you not like that a <laughs> show of strength right there he's in the angry mood don't you don't don't bother him <laughs> i have been sold this property more times than i care to count beginning in homeland I, I can no longer recall most of my years I've been spent living in terror. You're safe with me, I swear it. You are Targaryen. You can afford to play. This accent is weird. It's like Caribbean. <laughs> he really likes that. Now, uh, the hand's daughter is going to visit him again, or maybe not. I have decided to take a new wife. The hand's daughter. I intend to marry. The Lady Alicent Hightower before Spring's End. <laughs> the hand manipulated this whole situation, man. This is an absurdity. My house is Valerian, the greatest power in the realm. And I am your king.
I didn't excuse you. <laughs> Betrayal. Man, uh, you got manipulated, dude. Like, that wasn't a wise decision. What the hell? Waiting in the Stepstones is a chance for you to prove your worth to any who might yet doubt it. We are the realm's second sons, Damon. Our worth is not given. Let's be taken. Must be made. Or made. <laughs> What was that, like, that mask made of, like, other dead skin or something? The uh, intrigue is building in the show. <laughs> um, I can see the, uh, the Valerian, um, is, uh, siding with the prince. He's always kind of sided with the prince, uh, Prince, uh, Damon, but, um, it may... I don't know. Is he trying to talk his way into doing a coup? Um, and the king, I think, made a ill, not a good choice. Uh, he was, come on, man. You be manipulated. She was just playing to your emotions. She was told to by her father, the hand, um, the hand of the king. And um, I don't know. He's grieving, so I guess it's easy to miss when you're being kind of manipulated in a way. But um, the intrigue is definitely building. I can see where it's going, but you know, um, Game of Thrones traditionally through curveballs. Um, and I don't really know who to trust yet. Uh, you know, uh, I like the princess, but uh, we'll see. We gotta watch a few more episodes but um anyways uh thank you for watching big time nights uh make sure you uh, like comment subscribe if you want to see more of these uh reactions to this show uh, let me know but anyways uh until next time peace